Hi there guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you two edits on autumn effect you can apply to your color images and also to your black and white images. We have these two images here. I'll be applying the autumn effect. I've discovered this way of doing a natural autumn effect on your images and I hope you stick along with me till the end of the video. We're in Photoshop now please don't scare away from the word Photoshop it's a very simple method I'll be showing you step by step and you can follow along on one of your images. Okay now the first thing we're gonna do is go to the side of the panel and make a duplicate background. The next thing we're going to do is go up to the filter, choose Blur, Gaussian Blur, and you then this little window pops up and you will see your image blurred. You have the radius pixels here. I set these to to the radial uh, the pixels of my camera, the megapixels, which is around 30, 31. Click OK. And now you're gonna see this image, it's all blurry. Don't worry, all you have to do. To do this special effect that I told you I discovered. Go up to the image panel here, to the image, go on adjustments, click on brightness contrast and another small window pops up. Now we have brightness and contrast. We're going to raise the brightness again depending on your camera's megapixels and the contrast just push it all the way up to the 90s around 96 to the late 90s click OK now here we have again the blurry image is gone brighter and darker don't worry just go over to the opacity on this side of the screen click the down button and reduce the slider all the way down and there you're back to your normal image now the best setting I found is around 13 you push it up slowly slowly to around 13 or depending on your liking if you go up even more than 13 you will see it's a bit too much so push it down between 10 and 13 and you can see the effect on your image click on this eyeball for the before and after and there we have the first colored images image with the autumn effect now I'm going to switch over to the black and white image and we're going to do the same thing we duplicate the image the background image on the right side go up to the filters blur Gaussian blur your megapixels camera your settings on your camera what they are click OK Again, we have a blurry image. Go up to the image on here on the top left corner. Adjustments, brightness and contrast. And here again, we're going to increase the brightness to around 30s. And the contrast all the way up. Not to 100, between 95 and 100. Click OK. 
again it's gone darker and brighter go over to the opacity again and lower it all the way down you back to your original image increase the opacity slider you can see it slowly blurring away going back to 13 again and you can see the before and this is the after on black and white I tend to dial it up a bit more to get that ethereal look and there we are well I hope you enjoy this quick edit thank you for watching Make sure to watch my other editing videos. Thanks a lot and hit that subscribe button and see you guys. Bye.